Hey what is going on guys welcome back to my channel and in today's video I'm going to be showing you an awesome 100k squad builder on FIFA 16. So this team is like a mixture between a Premier League and a Spanish League team and um, you know it's really overpowered it's definitely a team you should try and pick up um, and it's performed very well for me in the past when I've used it. Um, so I'll start off with in goal I have gone with Mandanda this guy's an absolute beast all of his cards. Um, I go with this 86 rated inform card, but you know if you have more coins you could go with this team of the season card um, Or if you don't have as many coins you could get his any of his other informs or even just his rare gold card This guy is an absolute beast all of his cards are as you can see from his stats He's got 90 diving 89 reflexes 88 handling 88 positioning and 79 kicking so this guy is very solid in goal really good shot stopper and um, Just a great goalkeeper in general to be honest definitely a player you should put in goal um, one of the best in the game I think in my opinion right centre back I have gone with Koscielny uh, really nice card you know he gets that great link with uh, Mandanda and um, overall one of my favourite centre backs actually in FIFA 16 because of how fast he is and how good at defending he is uh, he's very similar to the other centre back he is with which is Varane as you can see they've got very similar stats they're both very fast players and have got very good defending and overall really solid centre backs um, and also for their price, you know, definitely players you should try and pick up. Um, as for my left back, I've gone with Tremolinas. Gets that really nice link with Varane. Um, 85 pace, 77 defending and 74 physical. Um, so really nice all-rounded stat. Uh, great player and I think he's like very cheap as well, similar to the, to the two centre-backs. As for my right back, I have gone with Bellerin. Uh, this guy is just absolutely rapid as you can see from his card. He's got that 95 pace. I think he's one of the fastest right backs in the game. Um, you can basically catch up with any attackers with this guy um, and he's just going to nip in there and win the ball back. Overall this is probably one of the most overpowered defences I've actually used in FIFA 16. Um, probably one of the most overpowered you can actually get um, just because of how quick all these players are and how good at defending they all are as well. Um, con you'll concede very few goals with them you know even in Division 1. Um, and overall really good defence, definitely, definitely defenders that you should pick up. Um, and as for my central midfielder on the left, I have gone with Kracharyak, who gets that perfect link with Tremolinas, as you can see. This guy has actually got better defending and physical stats than my centre-backs, which is kind of funny. But, um, you know, he's very quick as well. As you can see, he's got 71 pace, which is pretty decent for a centre midfielder. Um, and 72 passing, which is also pretty decent. And overall, this guy's just an absolute rock in the middle. He's going to win... He's going to win everything in the air. He's going to win the ball back um, through slide tackles, you know, any sort of tackles. This guy is just, he'll, he'll just sit in front of the back four and basically sweep it up um, and, and just stop you from conceding goals, basically, um, on counter-attacks and stuff. As my central midfielder, I have gone with Fabregas, as you can see here. Um, mostly just because of his shooting and passing. This guy has got 90 passing, as you can see. And he's just he's just so good at threading the ball through to my attacking players um, with those through balls and stuff. And this guy's long shots are just insane. If you get the ball around the edge of the box with Fabregas, definitely try and get a shot off with this guy. Because 9 out of 10 times, he's going to find the back of the net. He's an absolute beast going forward. Um, and then as for my right central midfielder, I've gone with a player which likes to get up and down the pitch all game basically. And it's one of my favourite central midfielders. And that is Ramirez. I don't think there's any other player like this guy um, in midfield in the game just because of how quick he is and how good at defending this guy is. Um, you know, he's very fast with that 88 pace and he's also got 78 defending as well, which is very good. He's up and down the pitch all game, you know, winning the ball back, uh, starting attacks. One of my favourite sort of all round central midfielders in the game, in my opinion. And then to link up with him to get those perfect links with Fabregas and Ramirez, I've gone with Willian. Again, a really solid player, a really fast player, as you can see, 89 pace and 85 dribbling, so he's really quick going forward. He's also got really good shooting and passing stats as well, um, and overall, he'll get you loads of goals, this guy. He is very overpowered on that right-hand side. Similar to this guy on the left, which is Connor Plianka. Um, I've just gone with his normal card. Obviously, you could get his inform card if you have more coins, but his normal card is just as insane, basically. As you can see, he's got 92 pace, 84 dribbling. And he's also got really good shooting and passing stats as well and is very solid on that left hand side. Um, anything that you put through to this guy, he's going to sort of latch onto it, you know, and defenders aren't going to be able to catch up with him and he's going to find the back of the net most of the time. And then moving on to my striker, the most expensive player in the team, definitely worth every single coin though, 
second man of the match Gamero. As you can see from his stats, this guy is an absolute beast. Uh, with that 84 pace, 86 dribbling, 89 shooting, 85 passing and 78 physical. This guy feels so quick on the ball, you know, with that with that pipe with that pace and dribbling. Um, he can just sort of weave in and out of defenders so well. And then with that 89 shooting as well, he can just score from anywhere. You know, long range, one-on-one uh, -on -one with the goalkeeper from tight angles. He's just going to smash the ball past the goalkeeper most of the time. Um, and he's just an absolute beast. Everything you'd want from your striker. Um, and one of my favourite strikers in FIFA 16, actually. Um, and it also works very well with that 85 passing. Um, he can find that sort of left forward and right forward very well all game, you know, with the three balls and stuff. He also feels pretty strong on the ball as well with that 78 physical. Um, he's definitely a very hard player to get off the ball, and in my opinion, is sort of the, just a complete striker to be honest. You know, he's got everything that you'd want from your strikers, all the attributes you'd want from a striker, and feels very similar to Aguero in my opinion. And for 38,000 coins, I think on um, Xbox, you know, is an absolute bargain. Definitely try and pick up this guy if you have the coins. And in general. Definitely try and make this team. It's one of the best uh, 100k teams I've actually made on FIFA 16 so far. Um, really, really overpowered. Definitely try and get it um, if you have the coins. So yeah, that's today's video, guys. Remember to leave a like if you enjoyed and subscribe if you're new around here. And I will see you in the next video.